Well, in this a short video, I'm going to show you how you can use a graph to solve an equation. So we've been given the uh, equation y equals 2x squared minus 4x minus 1, and we want to find out where it has solutions. But first of all, you need to understand what is meant by solutions. Solutions to equations are when 2x squared, this, our equation, is equal to minus 1. So the solutions will be the values of x, values of x, that make 2x squared minus 4x just make sure I don't run paper here, equal to 0. I'll put that there. Okay, equal to 0. So, um, so it's a graphical solution, so we have to draw the graph. Now, sometimes a graph is given to you in a question, um, or sometimes you have to plot it. Um, I'm not going to be too bothered in this. Um, video showing you how to plot it. Let's just assume we've got it. So it's showing you how to use it if you've got it. So let's look at our graph here. I'll make it a bit smaller. So we can see that the graph um, goes through. I'll bring this up a little bit. Right, so it's important to know that the solutions are where the graph crosses the x axis. Okay, because on the x axis, y is equal to zero. Now, on an exam paper, you'll have a much clearer um, idea where it cuts. So all you're required to do to give the solutions is to estimate uh, where it cuts the x-axis. So in this particular graph I've got two there, three there, I've got one, two, three, four, five divisions. So it looks like it's going through at 2.2. So I'm going to put x equals 2.2 down as one of my answers. x equals 2.2. I put the graph back in front I then look on the other side, so I've got naught, and I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 divisions just to the left. Now they'll be quite happy in an exam for you to get it correct to one decimal place. So I'm going to say this is minus 0 0.2, so x equals minus 0 0.2. Uh, and it might even be that in an examination it's even clearer than this, so I bring this up now. Um, we can see that 2.2 .2 is actually a very, very good uh, estimate. That's definitely right to one decimal place. By expanding the graph here, you can see that. So it's just a fraction to the right of 2.2. .2. And then if I come across my other part here, so we've said minus 0 0.2. Let's have a look. Yes, we're much closer to minus 0 0.2 than minus 0 0.3. So that um, would be solutions to the equation. So we'll take the graph back and just remind you what we've done. We wanted graphical solutions to equations. We, um, I used the iPad just to illustrate to you exactly where we were. We had to estimate where it cuts on the axes. We set at minus 0 0.2 and at 2.2. .2. So it's the x values where we cut the x axis are the solutions to the equations we found using a graphical method.